In this video, we're going to attempt to solve the triangle drawn on the right. We know two of the sides are 9 and 3, but we need to find all the other missing sides and angles. I always like to get started by having two sides and two angles. Notice we already know two sides, but we only know one angle is 90 degrees. We don't know a second angle. So let's find a second angle, and it doesn't matter which angle we go after first, so let's just find the one in the top right corner. No particular reason, that's just the one I picked. So from that angle, we're gonna find that first piece always using trig. So from that angle, we've got 9 opposite it and 3 adjacent to it. And if I think about so ka toa, which one uses opposite and adjacent? The tangent does. So we can take the tangent of that angle theta is opposite over adjacent, 9 over 3. Which, if we divide, 9 over 3 is 3. To find a missing angle, then, we can't plug theta into our calculator, that won't work, so we do the tangent inverse of 3 to find what that angle is. The tangent inverse of 3, and if I round that to the nearest degree, let's do that, let's call it a 72 degree angle is equal to theta. That's a 72 degree angle up there. Now we know two sides and two angles. We know the sides are 9 and 3. We know the two angles, the right angle and the 72 we found. The last few pieces fall into place quite quickly. First, we know that the missing angle, let's call it alpha, and the other acute angle have to add to 90 degrees. Alpha plus 72 has to equal 90 degrees, so we'll subtract 72 from both sides. That leaves us with alpha is equal to 18 degrees. We have an 18 degree angle. Finally, we have one side left to find. To find the missing side, it's opposite the right angle, we call that one c, and use the Pythagorean theorem that a squared plus b squared equals c squared, equals c squared. So if we call 9a and b3, we get 9 squared plus 3 squared equals c squared. 9 squared is 81, 3 squared is 9. Combine like terms, we get 90 equals c squared. And we can find c by taking the square root of both sides. c is equal to 9.49. 9.49. We have now found the missing sides and angles of this triangle. 18 degrees, 72 degrees, and the side of 9.49. We solve this triangle by first identifying which piece we were looking for. We like to have two sides and two angles to get us jump started. We already had the two sides, but we only had one angle, the right angle. So we used our trig to find one more angle, and then we can find the missing angle by adding to 90, and the missing side by using the Pythagorean theorem.